Previously on Pokemon Fire Red. Departed the underground path for the next destination. He bought 6225 worth of potions and a lot of repels. In the SSN, took on Blue's Radicate with Umbreon in one handily. Departed from the SSN for the next destination. You know, these, these flashbacks really suck. And now... Welcome back to Pokemon Fire Red, ladies and gentlemen. Woo! So, you can see where we last left off. I'm still debating. Oh, by the way, you're probably noticing a few different things on uh, on this little uh, this little recording here. <laughs> That's because I've got new software, new hardware. Okay, maybe not new software, but I definitely have a new headset and a new controller. Finally. Oh my god. Oh yeah, I need to teach somebody cut. So, we go in here. Who's gonna be the lucky Pokemon? I'll teach it to Meowth. Machine set. So that's how it works. Yee! Meowth learned cut. Okay, so. Would you like to cut it? Yes, I would. Whee! <laughs> Oh, so yes, first off, we're going to take on Lieutenant Surge. Because, fuck yeah. I hate this gym, by the way. And I'll show you why. You have to look through each of these trash cans in order to find hidden switches. First, you, once you find the first one, the second one is always right next to it. But it never tells you which one it is. Well, I guess that's part of the point, but... Hi, I'm going to battle you now. No, oh, I'm not a light. I'm a lightweight. That's why I joined this gym and blah 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 blah. Yeah, you look nothing like your overworld sprite, dude. Oh, hi, Voltorb. And a Geo dude. Oh, hey, we're at the same level. I like this. Ha ha ha! You thought that was gonna work. Magnitude. Ooh, nice. Magnitude seven. Aw, oh, yeah. All right, and it, of course, it's super effective. You have a good ground type Pokemon, and this gym can be your bitch. Oh, Magnemite. Do they have Levitate in this version? I guess we'll find out. Ah! Sonic Boom. Magnitude 6. Oh, good. Oh, and it's more, even, even quadruply effective and shit, because it's like, yeah! Woot! Level 22 Geo Dude. Aw, oh, yeah, son. Engineer. Fried. Well, not so much fried as in covered in dirt, but, you know, close enough. Only dirt here. Not only dirt here. Hi! Arr, matey. This, this be no place for kids, not even if you're good. Really? Well, then, I'll just have to show you what's for now, won't I? A Pikachu. Yay! Look at that little Pikachu. He's just a cute little thing. Okay. Yeah, I'm a rock with arms, dude. So, yeah. This is a rock with arms. That can, like, shake the ground. This is gonna be just, just really, really easy. <laughs> well, that's fine with me. Uh, Pikachu? Yeah, we'll keep, we'll keep, we'll keep her in for right now. Uh, oop. Oh. Not very effective. Oh, shit. Magnitude 9! That's the second strongest uh, magnitude that you can get. Magnitude 10 is the strongest. And if we get magnitude 10, there's gonna be a party up in here. <laughs> yeah, I'll surprise you, alright. Now tell me there's no room for kids in here. I'll kick your ass a second time. Hey, there's a switch. Turn it on. There's the first electric lock. Oh, boom! Uh huh. Why? If there was one in there the entire time. Why couldn't I just let that be the first and that be the second? What the hell? Either way, the gates are open. And we gotta go through this old man. Uh, I'm Lieutenant Surge with my CEO in the army. Even though, well, so, so Surge must be an old man, right? <laughs> well, if you remember the title sequence to this series, you'll know better. Uh, mag oh, quick attack. Really? Okay. Magnitude 9. Ooh, so close. It would be awesome if I get to Surge's last Pokemon and it pulls out a magnitude 10. Holy shit, that would be awesome. Whee! 
Level 23 Geodude. Ah, yes, son. Stop! You're very good! You only had one Pokemon. I don't have a choice. It's not easy opening that door. Uh, and here he is, Lieutenant Surge, the Lightning American. Even though America supposedly does not exist in this universe. Maybe they mean Unova. But they never change it up in future games. Weird, huh? Alright, as always, even though we haven't been going for very long, ABS, always be saving. You always save. And here we go. Hey, kid, what do you think you're doing here? You won't live long in combat, not with your puny power. I tell you, kid, electric Pokemon saved me during the war. They zapped my enemies into paralysis. The same as I'll do to you. So, yes. <coughs> Excuse me. Lieutenant Surge! Ah, yes, the third Pokemon gym leader in the Kanto region, if you're starting in Kanto. And, well, let's see, he starts off with a Pokeball. No, that's Voltorb, as we've seen before. Ah, Sonic Boom. Magnitude 5. It should still be okay. Come on. Oh, so close. Alrighty. Oh, of course, he's going to use a Super Potion. Because he, 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 computer like to, tr likes to, really, magnitude four, now you're getting performance anxiety, Geodude, come on. Psh, what was that? You know, even, even if you are made of a Pokeball, that's still gonna hurt you, dude. Or, thing, I, I don't, I don't know, these things don't have gender. Alrighty, about to use Pikachu, oh. Of course. Now I've heard of Heart Gold Soul Silver, he will squee if you have a Pikachu with you. Oh fuck you. Fuck your double team. If I have to, I will pull out Umbreon. Magnitude 8! Yes! He gon' get you. Yay, and goodbye. You are the weakest link. Goodbye. Ah. Raichu, his final Pokemon. Too bad you don't. Too bad they didn't think of the whole uh, Pokemon fanfare for the final Pokemon, like, before Generation 5. Fuck you! I hate Double Team. Like I said, don't make me pull out my Umbreon. <gasps> oh, fuck yeah! Yeah! Magnitude 10! Oh, fuck yeah! Woohoo! Ha! <sighs> that was awesome! <laughs> that was fucking awesome! <laughs> <laughs> and that defeated him. <laughs> I, I, I am. I honestly was not trying to call that. <laughs> the Thunder Badge cranks up your Pokemon speed. Also lets your Pokemon fly lightning quick any time, kid. You're special, kid. Take this. Oh, TM34. I think that's Thunderbolt, or is it Shockwave? Yep, TM34 contains Shockwave. Teach it to an electric Pokemon. I just might. Or maybe I'll defy you and not teach you to an electric Pokemon. Hmm. So yeah, three down, five to go. Sweet! Ah, oh, that was that was awesome. <laughs> I'm glad I got this on video because <laughs> that was great. Oh, hey, what are you doing here? Oh, hello, Professor Oak's age. Uh, route two. Oh. Oh yeah, that's right. So we've got a thing to do. And while I'm over there, I'm going to do a trade. Because over there, just like the reg just like the regular game, there is going to be a Pokemon trade going on, and it is an Abra for a uh, Mr. Mime. So I'm gonna do that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. One Abra for one Mr. Mime. Yes, I know, I'm saving rather rather quickly there. So, uh, what's gonna happen here is I'm gonna go capture an Abra, and I'll meet you back here once I have one. So, uh, see when we get back. Alright, we are back, and we have an Abra. So, you want me to show you this Abra? Alrighty, so... Here we go, Abra. Really? It's the first one I put in the box. Oh, wow. I just want I had a few more. That's okay. I, it was like my third time trying to capture one. Um, how, how, how useful is a grass Pokemon going to be in the next few gyms? Let's see. Grass. 
poison, psychic, uh, fire, earth. Yeah, I, I think Otis is going to have to go back in here for now. Sorry, dude. But, for now, perhaps I could put Abra up front and let it gain some experience along the way. Because our next stop is going through Diglett's Cave. Oh, yeah. Diglett. Well, maybe I could have kept Oddish in there, but I have Marsh Stomp to cover those weaknesses, so... I don't know, I'm just finding more and more that I need Grass-types less. I don't know, but... Anyway, here we go, Diglett's Cave. It's a cave that's been pretty much dug out by nothing but Diglett. There's one now! It's a Whack-A-Mole! Okay, I'm gonna switch out. I don't know if I can run. Oh! Oh! Really? You're gonna play that game? Okay. Well, I'm gonna play this game. Really? Oh yeah, these little fuckers are fast, aren't they? Yeah. I might put one or two... I might, I might put on a repel after a battle or two, but... Right now... I'm gonna try and at least level up an Abra, level up this Abra at least once. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Arena tra Oh, fuck you, Arena Trap! What a Meowth has an item. Oh, it's digging. Oh, it's digging. Uh, will teleport work? I am kind of fucked. I am kind of fucked. Yeah, goodbye, Abra. Oh yeah, I can't escape, can I? That's okay. Because uh, I have Marsh Stomp. That's right. I have Marsh Stomp. I'm kind of fucked. <laughs> I was kind of fucked. Oh dear. That's right. These things have... Of uh, uh, fucking arena traps. I had forgotten all about that. You know what? Let's capture one. What the hell am I doing? Get in there. Stay in there. Good boy. It is a boy. There we go. I got a Diglett! You know, maybe I should have captured one and then tried to go capture an Abra. Uh, oh well. Live and learn. And hindsight 2020 is all of that good shit. Okay, time to turn on some repel. And I have no revives. Okay. So let's go back. Make sure Abra is all well rested and shit. And then, well, let's go on through. And get back through the caves in the Cave of Wonders. The Cave of Diglett. Because what I need to pick up over there as well is, um... <laughs> it's, it's actually uh, an HM that I need to pick up. So, really should have been picking up and capturing more Pokemon. But, hopefully I can I can change that. Uh, oh, oh, and it's already worn off. Because Repel is only 100 steps. Aww. Okay. What do you have? Person, ooh, nice! I got a person berry. Person berries, for those who don't know, are berries that, when eaten, cures confusion. All right, repel. Let's get through here. About the only thing that could stop me is a Doug trio. I say this and watch, you know. It would be my luck, like five seconds after I say something like that, I run into a goddamn Doug Trio. Or Repel wears off, that works too. You know. Because Doug Trio, I think I think up in here they'd be like twenty eight thirty or whatever, and then they could kick my ass. Okay. So nothing there. Good. Uh ding ding Okay. Okay, yeah, you're telling me something I'd already know. Look for the Pokemon Abra. Do you want to trade one for Mr. Mine? Yes, I do. Hi! 
Yay, we have a trade! Sweet! And, I, you know, I never... I don't think I've recorded a tra an in-game trade before. But here we go. We have Mr. Mime. Yay! Mime, mime, mime. <laughs> mime in. Oh, and of course, I gotta be careful of its leveling because, you know, badges and shit. But for the next two gems, it should be okay. Let's see what we've got. Of course, it's gonna be the same level. Soundproof barrier, confusion substitute. Actually, it's gonna be decent. So I'll put them up front, and I'll just run through Mount Moon. Uh, but let's go get the uh, HM first. And then we'll, we'll cut to when I get through Mount Moon again. Meowth! Okay. Oh, hi, you. I'm one of Professor Oak's aides. Ten species. Uh, do I have ten species? I think I do. Eight kinds? Uh-oh. I have to go and get more species. Oh, that's fine. An ether. Okay, then. What's this? A paralyzed seal. Okay. Eh, I could probably grab a couple more. There's probably Weedle, Kakuna, you know, Caterpie over here I can grab up real quick. It's no big deal. You know. And considering I have no room in my party, they'll just go straight to the PC, so, uh, Let's see what Fusion will do to you. Will it kill it? That's the question. Yes, it will. It will kill it. Okay, so let's grab two more Pokemon because we need to have HM5. Oh. Uh, so, okay. Here we go. Ah, fuck! Okay. Yeah, you don't want me to kill you here, Rattata. Fucking Rattata. Fuckers. Get in the Pokeball, stay in the Pokeball, get to the PC where you belong. You know, if I wanted to be really mean, I'd dedicate a box to the PC, name it, name it, name it, Rattata Camp, and there you go. Boy, that's really harsh. Huh. I am not fond of the Rattata line. As I mentioned in a previous episode. No! Yeah, go away! Need one more different species. Come on, give me a bug, give me give me something, you know? Ugh. Do do do. Oh come on! Fucking Rattata. This is a slow-paced episode, isn't it? <laughs> or this is slow places I let it. Alright, if I don't get a different species of Pokemon that I don't already have in this one, I'm gonna be... Yeah! Yeah. It's gonna be cutting time. Because, fuck this. Alrighty, there we go. Alright. When I get another... Okay, when I get another Pokemon, I will be right back. Okay, it didn't take as long off screen as I thought it would, but still, it's a fucking Weedle! There we go. One. Hey! Stay in the Pokeball! What's wrong with you? Fucking little. Ugh. Alright, let's get in there. Get in there. Whoop! Ah! Really? You don't want me to poison you, dude. No. No, I'm the one who's poisoned. Fuck! You don't want me to attack you, that's what I meant to say. Okay, get in there. Get in the Pokeball. That's where you belong. You belong in the Pokeball, in the PC. You know, you know, hit the street corners of the PC world and, 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 
and, and, and you know, doing the things. I don't know. Do you think people in Pokemon Universe wore out their Pokemon? They, they, they probably do. I mean, it make it, it would it would make sense. I mean, you got other kinds of crime and corruption in the Pokemon Universe. You would think poke poke prostitution would happen. And people are now screaming at me that I ruined their childhoods. <laughs> oh come on! If you've if you've watched the Quartz Run, your childhood is already ruined. There we go. Ten kinds of Pokemon. Finally, Flash. Okay, so we have Flash. Good. Uh, who can get it? You know what? I'm gonna give it to Mr. Mime. Because why the hell not? All right, ABS, always be saving. All right, and when we come back, I will I will cut through because I'm just gonna go take the long way through Mount Moon so Mr. Mime here can get some levels, and I'll meet back with you guys in Cerulean City. Toodles. You're not Clement. All right, we are back, and right quick, yes, I'm gonna go ahead and save. Um, just saving real quick. I leveled up Mr. Mime a little bit. I believe he's up to uh, Mr. Yep. Yep, level 15 there. Meowth has picked up another item along the way that I never noticed. Peachy Berry. Nice. So, we're good to go. Mr. Mime's going to take the front here because, uh, well, Erica's gym not only is grass type, but she also has grass and poison types. So, we're going to take her on there. Whee! I want to ride my bicycle. I want to ride my bike. So, yay! Alrighty. Hi! You have Pokemon with you! You're mine! Well, that's not creepy. Uh, four Pokemon. Oh! Oh, yeah! So we get to have a case in point. Confusion. Hooray! Because you're part poison type, so you're, you're gonna uh, just kinda you know, fall to the confusion. Woot! Oh, shit. Bellsprout? Really? Okay. Okay. Confusion time. Oh yeah. <sighs> Whoop! Yeah, that's the good thing about traded Pokemon. Of course, they gain experience a lot quicker than their native brethrens and sistrens and, and other ends. Of course it's super effective. Oh, you bitch! You son of a bitch. God damn it. I didn't want to be poisoned today. I was poisoned today! Yeah. Yeah, that, that, okay. If you laughed at that, thank you, but, but, you didn't have to. Another bell sprout, huh? Jeez. You know, by the way that, that animation goes off, you, it makes you wonder, like, it's like Bellsprout comes out and Maimon is like, shaken in fear, even though it's really just the poison. Whoop. Two levels in that one battle. Well, of course. You deceived me! I did not! How did I deceive you? You need Flash to get through there. Yeah, that's why I went and picked it up. All right, what's in the berry pouch? Oh, hey, cool, peach berry. Meowth, what did you pick up again? Okay, what'd you get? What did you get? Another cherry berry. Okay, sure. Uh, let's put Meowth up in the second spot for now. Okay, oh, hey. Aerial Ace, very nice. Okay, hi. How you doing? Wah! Great! I was bored, eh? You're Canadian? Wait, Canadians exist in the Pokemon universe? Oh no, a Machop. This is gonna be fun. <laughs> oh, so close. 
Meanwhile, you sit there and f you sit there and focus. I'm already gonna like just kick your ass. There you go. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Okay. Boom. Hello at level 18. Okay then, Onyx, huh? You know what? I want to give I want to give uh, somebody else a chance at this. Marsh Tom, come on out. Uh, hooray! And I just can't I can't wait till I can get Surf, because that'll be awesome. You're all wet. Uh, oh hey! Another level up for Mr. Marshtomp! Hooray! Keep it coming, eh? Oh wait, I'm out of Pokemon! You forgot to put an A in there. I'm out of Pokemon, eh? Sure I got standing up to me there, eh? Yeah, I did. Because, well, you're Canadian and by nature you're supposed to be nice. Hi, how you doing? Who's that block in there with those good little Pokemon? You trying to come on to me? Wow! I didn't know you swung that way, little boy. But that's fine, because uh, I don't, but I am comfortable enough with my sexuality to see that as a compliment and take it as such. That's that's okay. Yeah, Growlithe. Little puppy. Eh. Oh, dear. Eh. Yeah, at least you're not burning me. Haha. -ha. I know one of these trainers is supposed to have a bee drill. Somewhere. Maybe it was this one? Nope. This one is Charmander, though. So, uh... You know what? Just for the hell of it, I'm gonna send out Meowth. Hi! Hello there, Meowth. Let's see, I have Fight, Scratch, Growl, and Cut. You know what? Nom. <laughs> He flinched. Um. Uh, really? Okay. Uh, you know, every time you flinch, I'll, you know, I'll take the flinchings. That's not good. Eh. <laughs> Bite. Um. Eh, my attack's already lowered. Thank you for burning me. Uh, except fight is classified as a dark move, which means it's special, right? And Meowth is gone. Fuck! Okay, fine, Pidgeotto. And yes, I know, I could end it quickly with some of the other Pokemon that I have, but I want to be a little challenging at least. Okay. Out like a light! Yeah, so what else you got to say to me? Keep walking! Oh, fuck you too, buddy. Oh, I think this guy has a drill. Get up early every day to raise my Pokemon from cocoons. Ooh. Cocoons. See, this one has a drill. Big fucking three-foot bee. With, with thorns for hands and pissed. A perpetually pissed Pokemon. drill. Woot! Meanwhile, Mr. Mime is growing up to level 19. Light screen, light screen. Nah, I you typically don't worry about those moves. Again, I typically don't worry about those moves. Whoa. Another bee drill, huh? Well, shit, why not? Mr. Mime can use the experience. Here you go. Goodbye. Eee. Boom! Look at that. Mr. Mime's already caught up to most of the rest of the gang. What? What a total waste of time. Hey! There's no that's no way to talk about your Pokemon. I have to collect more than bugs to get stronger. Yeah, no shit. How about something that's, you know, something that's decidedly not what the f Motherfucker! I am going to kick your ass. 
Apparently my net's back. Okay, fine. But don't do that again. Okay. So, picking up where we left off. <clears throat> uh, let's just get back to the Pokemon Center. So back at the Cerulean City Pokemon Center, uh, yeah, I cut back here because um, there were some technical difficulties I needed to cut out. Because, well, as I was recording this, my internet connection was gone. And when it came back, my computer decided to let me know in the only way it knew how. Immediately open Bing! I don't know why it would do that. I don't know why it thought it needed to open Bing and say, hey, the connection's back, instead of just... Doing it quietly like it's supposed to. But you know what? The connection's back. As of this as of this moment in the video. I don't know why you guys care. I don't know I don't know if you guys would care. I care. And it may affect the video. Who knows? But here we go. More caterpie, please. Ah. This is going to be fun to edit, I'll tell you that right now. Um, you know what? Meowth is going to need to get more screen time. Come on. Meowth. Nom. Still faster than a Weedle. Ow! You motherfucker, come here. Nom. Ow! You po- Ooh. You know, if there was... Oh, shit. Really? Wow. Spamity spam. Well, I guess I suppose I can't talk very much because I'm doing the same thing. 222 points. A Venonat. Ooh. Let's go for something stabby. It's Mr. Stabby. La 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 la. Okay, you've got confusion. Okay, then. Why do you use Foresight on me? You can hit me with moves and stuff. Oh, nice! Cut you down to size! Fuck yeah! <laughs> my bugs! No, oh, my beautiful bugs! If you don't like bug Pokemon, you bug me! Oh, well, you bug me anyway, because you're... Hi! Let's gonna go see what the grass is here. Taking the rock tunnel to Lavender Town, huh? Okay. Sure, why not? Oh, a Rattata. Nice. That, that, that's, yes, 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 fuck you. Goodbye. Fucking weak-ass Rattata Pokemon. I mean, I know there are ways you can make Rattata work for you, but... Yeah. He's just meh. It's not as bad as Zubat for me. But it's, it's pretty up there. It's, it's just like, really? <sighs> uh, but I suppose that's the curse of being a common, you know? Ooh, I better be careful with Minden's experience. At least until I get something that can actually, you know, up the level of how many, uh, up the level of uh, traded Pokemon I can have without it going all on me. So, okay. The rock tunnel. Yes, I did put a Pokemon in the rock tunnel that I may or may not run into. That I do remember. I remember it vividly because I had to test it. <laughs> uh, I test. I did a test for most of these uh, in terms of like rare Pokemon you could find, um, and the rock tunnel is no exception. Mm. Oh, I was about to say if it got poisoned, I was gonna, I was gonna be pissed. Alrighty. Whee! Aw, so close. Can't measure up. No, you can't. Because you suck. Who can we find in here real quick? Can we find somebody interesting in here? It's a Spiro! Let's see how let's see how much confusion does to you. We'll probably kill it. Just watch. Yep, 
Told you. Death by confusion. And that's okay. Ah, well. I'm not going to stick around too much in there. Hi, dude. Aren't you a little toughy? Yes, I am a little toughy. Actually, I'm a big toughy. Got a big old belly. But, well, of course, it doesn't show on this. I'm still proud of my sprite work for this, honestly. You know, I mean, I know in the long run it doesn't take much, and it's obviously a better... Um, it would obviously be a better testament if I actually was able to do them from scratch, but, you know, for what I've done, I mean, I'm kind of proud of it. So, you know, just, just saying. Another Geodude, huh? Eh, why not? Magnitude 8. Ooh. Ow, 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 Okay, you're gonna play that game. Alright. Alright, I see. I see your game. I see it. Okay, goodbye, Geodude. Boom! Level 22. Here's my hope. Oh, shit! Magical Leaf! First of all, okay. Get rid of... Barrier. Because, again... I very rarely use defensive moves on most of my Pokemon, at least when I'm playing through the game. Uh, Machop, huh? Okay. Woo! And down you go. Bye-bye, Machop. It was nice knowing you. Actually, it wasn't. What's that? Your mother... Kids should be tough. Yeah... Yeah, they should. I agree. Kids should be tough. Not like the pansies they're raising in the public schools nowadays. God damn. Hi. Don't you dare patronize me. You just sought me out for a battle. I'm not gonna try and patronize you. You just you just come along and I'll kick your ass like everything everybody else. Hey, a meowth! I've got one of those! Uh hey, I also have magical leaf. Let's see how this works. Well, that's not bad. Ow. What? Goodbye, Meowth. Mm. No, you're too much! You're too much! Yeah. You're obviously talented. Good luck to you. Okay, good. So you're not as much of a, of a bitch as I thought you would be. Great. Alrighty. Hey, a Pokemon Center. Hey, how are you doing? Match up differently with each other. Yeah, we get the idea. Okay, so here we go. Healing up more Pokemon. Fuck yeah! Mm. Uh, who are you? Oh, yay! Ever present age super. 20 species, huh? Do I have 20 species? Let's see. Uh oh, only 10. <laughs> I need to. I need to catch 10 more kinds of Pokemon. Yeah, even though my Pokedex reads 13. What? What? I think they're only counting Kanto Pokemon for these. <laughs> it's only counting the Kanto Pokemon. Okay, let's see what you want. Hi. I always lose. Well, that's because... Let's see what you've got. Let's see what you got. Um, oh dear. Two Pokemon. You have a Pikachu. Okay, that's not bad. Okay, I have a level 20 Pikachu. How are you losing at the nearest gym? I mean, just because electric and water and you'd have fried Starmie. And you have fucking double team. Because people like to spam double team in these games. Motherfuckers. There's a reason why people playing the metagame do not like double team. There's just, you know, there, there is a reason for that. Oh, Clefairy. Okay. Oh, hi, Meowth. How's your sex life? And Meowth is female. This Clefairy is most likely also female. Yep. So if there's any kind of cute charm or anything, then, uh, yeah, no, no problem. <laughs> it was so great, I got an encore. Oh, nice. That's so sweet. That's so sweet. Oh, no. You are not singing me to sleep. No! 
Fuck your singing. You sound horrible. You sound worse than Pierce Brosnan. Oh, of course, it ends right when I go to sleep. Apparently, whatever Meowth picked up does not wake me up. Oh. Ow. Follow me. Okay. Um, you're the only one. I don't need to worry about you not being the center of my attention. Okay, bite, 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 bite. A more encore! Okay! I'm just gonna keep on biting you until you get, you know, until you are done. Ow! Oh, what will you mother... F Double slap my ass! That's a triple slap! Double slap my ass! That might feel good, but that's not for here or near there. That's like, really? Uh, there. Go away. At least Pidgeotto gets a level. Stupid Clefairy. After all my training! Yeah, well, I noticed some Pokemaniacs prowling around. Can you imagine? Them, up here in the mountains. Hey, nerds can be mountain climbers. So, okay, we restore Meowth. You know, I need to put Meowth up front. Just because, eh, why the hell not? Okay, restored your Pokemon full health. Hooray! Good. Let's go. <sighs> yeah, we're in the rock tunnel. Normally, this is all you can see. But... Use Flash. And there you go. Different games light up the area different ways. This obviously lights it up completely. What do you have? Oh, a cherry berry. No wonder. Okay. Let's go. First couple of Pokemon battles just to see what's in here. And then we'll put on the repel after a little bit. Um, let's see. A bat. A bite. Bite a bat. Bite a Zubat. Fuck you. She used to scratch and bite me. Before, she was much, much meaner. Now all the poodles run to my house for the funky cold Medina. That was random. I realize that. I apologize. No, I don't. I do not apologize for that. And I don't apologize for Meowth snapping out of confusion, too. Okay. So it looks like... Maybe I'll capture this Zubat. You know, it's not going to be in my party. I don't plan on raising up a crow. Never mind. A little too strong. That was too strong of a bite! <laughs> Pokemon fight! Ready? Go! <laughs> These Pokemaniacs. What is that even supposed to be? I mean, I, I can't even tell. What is... What, what kind of Pokemon are you? How do you do the things you do? Can you share your secrets deep inside? Cubone. Cubone, bone, bone. Boom, 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 boom. No. Ow. Okay, yeah. Not taking any chances. Fucking Pidgeotto come on out. Because at least if it tries to use a ground type attack, Pidgeotto. <laughs> even if it's even if it's throwing a bone, which which it qualifies as a ground type attack, it 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 doesn't do it. It it will not hit Pidgeotto. There we go. Ooh, nice. Critical. Okay. More leering. Gust. Yeah. We can do this. Could dance all day. Could dance all day. Ow. But not like that. We can't dance all day like that. Oh. Oh, shit. You're getting real now, folks. There we go. And Slowpoke, huh? Um, what do I have that can take on a Slowpoke? You know what? It's part psychic. Let's bring out my Umbreon! Oh yeah, son! Because <laughs> it has faint attack, and it can faint attack your ass back to wherever the hell you came from. Ooh, nice! Oh, this is third generation rules, honey. 
So, Fange Attack runs off the special stat this time. Oh, that's unfortunate. Ah, uh, I wish I had access to Snarl. I know it's not the most powerful dark move out there, but you know what? I love it. It hits multiple Pokemon in like horde battles or double or triple battles or whatever. And hello, Mankey. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm running away from that one. You know what? Let's put a Pokemon up there. Um, actually, no. Marsh Tomp can go up there. And I'm going to turn on the Repel. Because uh, I'm, I'm going to save my... Uh, yeah, let's let's save my uh, battling for the fucking actual trainers, like this guy. I draw illustrations of Pokemon when I'm home. Uh, I really shouldn't do that. My girlfriend draws illustrations of Pokemon. I mean, you know, look at the title card artwork. Ah, oh, really? A slow poke. Okay. You know what? I'm gonna bide. Bide my. Really? How the fuck? How the motherfuck? That is some clever shit. That was some clever shit. Disabled no more! Yay! Good. Bite, bite, bite. Eh. Storing energy, though. Whoa. Oh. Oh, yeah. Good. <laughs> kind of wish it worked out a little, little bit better than that, but that's okay. Bite, 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 bite. Oh, really? Okay. That's 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 one that's not going to work. Uh, confu- Ooh, there we go. Arr, she blows. Not going to be a lot. I'm probably not going to do much, but it'll help. Yeah. Oh! Ah! Really? Again? Okay. Goodbye. What? Level 23, fuck yeah! Whew, I'm exhausted! It was one Pokemon battle. Sheesh. A revive. That'll come in handy. Now, uh, let's see, the question is... You know what, I have these super potions, I may as well use them. Um, uh, Meowth. Bidgeotto. And Mr. Marshtomp. There we go, we should be okay. Hi, how you doing? I don't have to come here, but I will battle you. Okay. Sure, why not? It would be it would be a hell of a first date. I can tell you that much. Oh, of course. Yeah, this is not gonna bode well for me at all. Well, hey, mudshot. I can at least pick on the poison typing. Does it for? Ooh. Oh yeah, lower speed, sleep powder. Eh, you missed. <laughs> Well, there we go. Uh, Bulbasaur, huh? Well, you're a grass type. I'm a flying type. I don't think it'll work out. I'm sorry. It, it, I just don't see it working out. But we'll give it a shot anyway. I probably should be teach Pidgeotto Aerial Ace. Ugh. Well, that hurt, but not very much. Goodbye, Bulbasaur. Mm. What? Oh, I lost. Yes, you lost. What you gotta say? Big ones are too scary. Okay. Good for you. Hi! How you doing? Do you know about Pokemon cosplay? Yes. In fact, uh, at this past MAGFest, MAGFest 2014, there was this really cute girl dressed up as an Umbreon. Naturally, I got pictures of her. <laughs> uh, 
Yeah, I spend a lot of time on TV tropes, and recently I was spending time on the Pokemon TV tropes pages. Naturally, I naturally I know what my signature mon is, what well, not is going to be is, and that is Umbreon. I don't always use Umbreon, but I tend to keep Umbreon with me, and Umbreon is naturally my favorite Pokemon. There's a reason why Umbreon is in my Pokemon title cards. Oh, so yay. Lear! King Lear, even. Ah. I should experience play. Hmm. You know, I don't think that's what I've seen, or read, even. Hmm. I might have to check it out. I mean, in high school, we did study some Shakespeare. Yes, a southern... A southern rural high school that studied Shakespeare. You know what? Let's see if I run into that Pokemon I put in here. Nope! Not this time! I'm gonna just run unless I run into it. Then I'm gonna try. Because I've not fought it yet. I've not actually sat there and fought it. Oh, hey, I'm a chop! You know what? Let me try and capture you. Because, why not? Ooh, we're getting close. So, let's throw a Pokeball at it. I should upgrade. I really should. But I could do that when I get to Lavender Town. Whee! Get in the Pokeball! There you go, buddy. One, two, three. Yes! I got a Machop, I got a Machop, yay! You can hurl 100 grown-ups. Shit! Is it, do they mean just any grown-ups, or do they have to be a certain kind of grown-ups? I mean, that, that's, that's, this is stuff we need to know, man. My Pokemon techniques will leave you crying! Oh, well, maybe. You have only one. And he's a Geodude. That you chose not to evolve for some reason. Whee! Ah, uh, critical hit. Yay! Oh, wow. I don't know if that picked up, but there is thunder about somewhere. But that's okay. Okay, we're up here. Let's turn on the repel again. Because the Pokemon in question is only on the bottom floor. Alright. Let's get through as much as we can. Ah, fuck. It's gonna run into one of them. This tunnel goes a long way, kid. Not really. I mean, it, it's kind of fake longevity because, well... Let's be honest, you've got the Pokemon battle slowing you down, plus the fact that they just twisty and turny it and everything, and it's only two floors. So that's how you get the longevity out of it. That's why it's a long-ass tunnel. Another Geodude. Wow. But at least Marshtop is getting a good workout. Whee! I will tell you this, Sabrina's gym, the, the, uh, the uh, fifth gym... That's going to be Umbreon's time to shine. Hmm. What? Mud Sport. I don't need Mud Sport. I have... See, it would be useful... If... Nah, it's switching to Pidgeotto. It would be useful if Marshtomp did not have the ground typing. But it does, so... Yeah, that kind of makes Mudsport a little, uh... You know, a, a little useless for him. Oh! Seismic Toss. About the only fighting move I will put on a Blissey. <laughs> Which, by the end of the game, I hope to have one. Oh, you win! Oh, you... You rapscallion, you! Oh, hey, we go down. Yay! Can we go down here? Nope. We gotta go this way. Ah! Do you know how you can avoid getting lost in the mountains? You can bend twigs as trail markers. Right. Because I'm totally going to be able to see those. 
Maybe if you do big enough twigs or something, I don't know. Hmm. So, who do we have? What do we have? Um, let's bide. Let's, let's see what you're gonna do. Oh, there you go. Uh-huh. Boom! Oh, you're gonna, you're gonna be sorry you did that. Good, but... What? Oh, fuck you, cute charm. Roll out. You, you, you're using roll out now. When, you know, you could have used it before. You're in love! Yay! You're in love, you use water gun. I am so trying not to see the sexual implications of this. Alright. Not sure how I'm doing on time exactly. As long as you're not being immobilized by love or something. Oh, yeah. But, um... But by the time this video is done, I'll be at Lavender Town. As long as we can go quickly. Alright, here we go. A Pidgey, huh? Okay. Water gun. Right on to Pidgey. Yeah! <laughs> oh yeah, by the way! You drug out something that can do this. Yeah, really smart there. Oh, no, no, no. Whirlwind, it doesn't give you a choice of who to pull out, unfortunately. But, uh, it would be interesting if it did. Oh, hey. You know what? It is time for a cat fight. Fuck yeah, cat fight! I mean this in the literal sense, not in the sexy moment. Payday. Oh. That's right, Meowth is the only Pokemon as of Generation 6 that learns Payday. Ow, 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 ow! Come on! Stay in there, stay in there with me! Stay in there with me! Yes! Okay. There we go. <laughs> Throw coins at me, why don't you? Sure! I will take all your money! Oh. Except Bite is a dark type move, and that goes off as special. Hooray! Um. Ah! Pink! <laughs> no! Ah! Umbreon, let's beat the shit out of this thing. <laughs> Your coins are in vain! at me, but they are in vain. Who do you think you are? The, 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 the fucking whoever it was. Wasn't it wasn't like Zenigata from Lupin the Third based off of a, a famous detective or something? That threw coins at criminals. Like the asshole that's just revving up his motor right outside my window. I bet, I bet you whoever that det famous detective was, they would probably throw coins at him. And whoever the fuck it was. Ah. Oh. So, hooray. Alrighty. Do I have to go through you? No. Wait, is this the lower one? I think this is the lower one. So I'm gonna try it. Can you beat my power? <laughs> I can beat your power any day, homeboy. <clears throat> oh, look at this, a Geo dude. Woo! Yeah, you're all washed up. These puns are horrible. That's why I will probably keep doing them. Ah. <laughs> uh. Oh, there we go again. Yay, water gun. Whoop. Oh, a graveler! Somebody traded up! And cheated, too! Because graveler, you know, Geodude is only supposed to evolve to graveler at level 25. Oh! Somebody cheated! 
Out muscled. Yeah. She's a little cheater. Yeah, I'm going by you. Okay, I believe I can get by these guys by going extremely out of my way. There we go. One more. Okay, it's a picnicker type. So I'm going to set me out up front. Here we go. I came this far looking for wild Pokemon. Well, if you go down to the basement, you find, might find one that's really cool. Rare encounter, though. I didn't run into it, but I heard it's there. Oh, hey! Another cat fight! Let's see if this one will go any better. Ah! Oh. Coins scattered everywhere! Nom! Nom! Shit! Okay. Let's just pull out and, um... Uh, you know, I got a bird. I think... Oh, yeah, there's a name raider in Lavender Town, isn't there? I could just change the name of this Pidgeotto to Bird. I might do that, too. Who knows? Ooh. Psh. Eh, yeah. Goodbye, Meowth. My Pokemon get stronger while yours just fall by the wayside. Ha 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 ha. Oddish. Okay. I'll do this. I can do this. This is no problem. Watch this. Yeah, I got this. I got this. I got this. Mm. I don't care if my evasiveness smells. Or fells. Or falls. It smells great. It doesn't keep me from using a gust on you, though. A Pidgey! Sweet! Another P a Pidgey. Okay. I can send out Meowth first. I probably should have done this with Oddish. That's okay. Meowth is out. And... Hello, Miss Geo dude. How are you today? Oh, Geodude is close to evolving. One more level. So sweet! Okay, then. Rock throw, huh? Sweet! Sweet, and Jemima's memories. I'm out of Pokemon! Okay, good for you. And there's the exit. I'm out of here. Okay, I don't want to fight anybody else, so let's go around. And here we are! Lavender Town! Right as Repel wears off. Ah, uh, so that does it. Oh, God. I have no idea how long this is going to be by the time I finish this up. Hopefully it'll be the hour, and it won't be any much over an hour, I hope. Uh, considering how much I had to actually cut. Okay, so, anyways, remember our mantra, always be saving, ABS. And there we go. So, yes, thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys are enjoying it so far. Uh, next time, we are actually going to go over to Celadon City. And not only take on the next gym leader, but see what Team Rocket's up to. Uh, but until then, this is Gomer the Ranting Thespian signing off. And stay tuned for the next ins exciting installment of Gomer Plays Pokemon Fire Red.